established in 1926 to counter the influence of British colonialism and to revive the faith amongst the Muslims following the abolishment of the Ottoman Caliphate. This movement now has 80 million members in 150 countries worldwide and is the single largest Muslim movement in modern times. But it all began in the Indian village of Kandla, where Muhammad Ilyas ibn Muhammad Ismail was born in the year 1886. The pioneering scholar studied Arabic and Persian in his early years and went on to enroll into the Darul Uloom Dioband, aged 20 years old. However, his call to service would come in the year 1925 while he was in Mecca performing his pilgrimage. A pivotal turning point that ignited in him the desire to dedicate his life to the spiritual revival and reform of Muslim India. When he returned from his pilgrimage, Muhammad Ilyas lost no time. He organized graduates from Deoband and Saharanpur and sent them to the southwestern region of Delhi, in a place known as Mewat, for the purpose of establishing a network of mosques and schools for its inhabitants. Although he did not officially assign any names to his movement, the group soon earned its title from the local people who simply called them Tablighis, or those who propagate the message. Today the members congregate in Bangladesh annually, attracting close to 5 million attendees. That's nearly 2 million more than the official statistics for the Hajj pilgrimage. Muhammad Ilyas' legacy constitutes the single largest group and collective effort in the Muslim world today. He died in the year 1944, following severe fatigue and intestinal infection due to his rigorous effort to spread Islam. No sorrow, no sadness.